Well, hey folks, this video is going to be a bit shorter than my normal productions. The reason is because we are busy, and I mean really busy. The black flies are busy too, as you can see. But that's just part of living in the woods. The black flies are here from Mother's Day to Father's Day, and then the mosquitoes take over. I'd rather deal with this than traffic and noise and people and pavement and all that, you know. Anyway, it was always my dad's dream to put a screen porch on the back of the camp. It's a dream that never materialized for him. We shared in that dream, and you've heard me talk about this project for a long time. As you can see, the project is underway. It's coming along great. Just Lori and I building this, but working together good. It's not our first rodeo. <laughs> it's coming together great. So I'm just going to share some of these building clips with you and put some music to it that matches our motivation. Yeah, it matches our enthusiasm. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to share this with you, get this out this morning. Then the project is just going to sit for a bit. <sighs> Helping a good friend put a metal roof on his barn. It's got really more of a project than one man should be trying to tackle. So I'm going to help him get that buttoned up. And then I'm going to get back over here, pick up where I left off, keep on filming, and get a longer video together for you next week, I guess. So anyway, hope you enjoy our little project here. Yeah. We, we've enjoyed it so far. So let's see how it goes. The deck is going to be coming off of here. You don't want to go and nail things like that right to your house. Water is going to get trapped between here and it's going to start rotting your sill. Okay, so I had put this little piece of flashing on here before. As you can see, I left a space so my corner trim and all my siding doesn't sit right on here because water is going to hit here and then it would be pulled up the end grain like a wick. So before I nail this on, I'm going to slip a flashing up under this. Then I will nail this to the flashing with my nails angling downward so no water that might get in there would get into the holes. So that's what I'm going to do.
Okay, so that's what we have so far. And uh, let's take a closer look and I'll show you what my plans are. This area here is going to get framed with pressure treated all the way around and there's going to be pressure treated plywood on the inside of it. It's going to make a dry storage space for kindling in the winter time and all kinds of stuff that I don't want under the camp where it's got a dirt floor. You watched us build this laminated girder. I'm going to put another one here out of pressure treated. This is going to be framed and then the pressure treated plywood here. That's going to be an incredibly strong support for the floor system. That's why I only use two by sixes for the floor joist because it's only a six foot span. So you'd be able to drive a truck up there. Then over here there's going to be another door. This area is just going to have a dirt floor. Probably, probably be where we store the kayaks in the off season. Now the roof system is going to go up right beneath that window and then slope down. It's going to be a shallower pitch than I had hoped for. The only way for me to achieve a steeper pitch would have been to move this wall in. Right now the structure is 12 by 12. 12 by 10 would have been just a little bit too small or lower this wall, which I didn't want to do. So the pitch will probably be a little bit shallower than that shed with the metal roof behind it. So that's the only thing I wish that we could have done differently, but it just wasn't in the cards here. Now up on top of the wall here, this is a full laminated header. So this is the load bearing wall. This is where the rafters will be sitting. I've got it tied in. Nails coming from both directions here to keep that from wanting to roll. Everything is seated really good. And I've got a rim joist going around here. There's going to be round log ceiling joist coming off of here, bolted through here. And then pine on top of them. Yeah. And that door is coming out. There's going to be a full glass door there coming onto the porch. So that's where we're at with the project so far folks. As you can see it's coming along really good. So when I'm done helping my buddy get his project wrapped up, I'm going to get back here, pick up where we left off, keep on filming, and hopefully we'll have some more building footage for you next week. But for now, I'm going to get this video edited, head to town, get it uploaded for you so you have it to view tomorrow morning. <laughs> Yeah, so that's it for this week, folks. All the best to you, and God bless. Frank and the boss out walking in the woods, living life happy and free. Tracks in the snow everywhere they go, there's a pokey way up in that tree. A beaver built a pond where they have some fun, taking life a day at a time. Best friends until the end Frankie and the boss Frankie and the boss Frankie and the boss